The Los Angeles band Tool continues to explore the darker side of life. Prison Sex, the second single from the band's current LP, Undertow, is a metaphor for child sexual abuse. The Power 30's Teresa Roncon spoke with Tool frontman Maynard James Keenan, and we warn you that this story contains images that some may find disturbing. Did you guys write that song? Why did you make a video about it? Uh, it was well. We generally, we write, you know, music. The music comes first, and then the uh, the ideas come afterwards. And the reason the ideas come afterwards is because the music ends up kind of tapping into something way down deep inside that hasn't been addressed yet or needs to be addressed. And that song was written out of need. So that's the video. Has anybody in the band experienced that personally, that wants to talk about it? That wants to talk about it? Yeah. <laughs> What's the next question? <laughs> I think there may be some question about prison sex because some of the uh, images are disturbing even though it's an animated video. Uh, what would you say to people who may question it? They have some soul searching to do. Do if you it's, think... If it's, some people have found it really disturbing and I've had a few friends that have found out that there have been some memories that they've repressed that they didn't remember for a long time. And there's some issues that they needed to address before they come out the wrong way. I think sometimes people repress those childhood memories to the point where they come out later in, in really ugly ways. Um, they pretty much dictate a lot of people's behavior, the way they deal with people on an everyday basis, their job situations, you know, everything. It just dictates their actions. And unless they can get a handle on what those memories were and work around them and work with them, I don't think that uh, they can really lead normal functioning lives. Do you find uh, beauty in horrific images? Yeah, yeah, definitely. How so? It's just there, you know? It's a part of reality, it's a part of life. Birth, death, light, dark, it's just, it's just there. The sooner people get to the point where they realize that the ugly stuff is just as important as the beautiful stuff, it goes hand in hand, I think that we can get on with evolving.